objective for this video is to discuss how pumps operate in terms of conservation of momentum. So firstly, let's look at turbo machine. So a turbo machine can extract energy from a fluid. And if it extracts energy from a fluid, it's what's called a turbine. And if it adds energy to a fluid, it's what's called a pump. So in this topic, we're going to be looking most at pumps. So uh, turbo machines that add energy to a fluid. So a pump, it essentially just con consists of some vanes rotating around some central point. So we've got some angular momentum. We've got a fluid then passes in um, into past those veins. So we have some initial inlet velocity. So the velocity components associated with our fluid. And then when we exit the fluid, we have, ex sorry, exit the pump, we have new velocity components. And those velocity components are changed due to the uh, axial velocity of our fluid and the tangential velocity of our pump. So looking more closely at fluid velocity, when we consider fluid velocity, um, the total um, velocity V is made up of the summation of components W and U. So we can then draw a relationship also with our axial velocity, that of our fluid, and our tangential velocity, which is of our pump. So, using a bit of Pythagoras' theorem, clearly V squared is going to be equal to, v, to our tangential velocity squared plus our axial velocity.